everyone, it's me, the main man, Lucky Lance, back out again with my team. We're doing this real late because Will didn't even know this guy wanted to get free cake and ice cream, so he's at a birthday party. Uh, we've been delayed for over an hour. a good friend and then turned into a bad friend because I'm late. You've done terrible things in your life. <laughs> yep, being late to drinking parties definitely up there at the worst. Well, and this is a great day for Will because he's getting free cake and ice cream. Now he's getting free liquor. This is... This is like a socialist dream. Joke's on you, I fucking didn't even get cake and ice cream and I had to pay for my own dinner. Sounds like you may have had a bad day then. I watched Endgame, it was pretty good. Oh. Eh, maybe so. I haven't seen it, seen it yet. But anyways, I'm the host with the most. Lucky Lance's, of course, is Wicked Will, the disgraced former local champion. Who, of course, Will, we're always very proud of you for always practicing safe sex. Yes. And Will practices the safest form of sex of all, never having sex. Yes. So there you go. You can't possibly catch an STD unless, if you never have sex, unless you're getting tattoos all the time. Then, then maybe you might yeah, catch. Yeah. Look at the sweet tats. Yeah. All blue yeah. None of us have tattoos. Dang. Me, Ryan, and Will, unless Ryan's holding like a like hiding a tramp stamp or something. <laughs> totally the dude for it. Yeah. <laughs> We do not have tattoos, and we have... Don't throw it in there. I always throw trash in You better not throw up in there. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, and then we got our ruling expert, Rad Ryan, way over to my extreme left. Uh, he, uh, without him, we'd be way stupider, and when he's not there at the shop, the IQ goes down massively. I mean, it really does, Well, Like, if he's not there, we're kind of, like, confused. Does Dark Hole send cards to the graveyard? Right, yeah. yes. Yes, he sends yeah, cards it, to the it graveyard. Yeah, it does, but... Someone might not know that, and they're not going to believe us, but they'll believe Ryan. Yep. It's really weird how that works. It does not, in fact, return them to your hand. Again. <laughs> and then, uh, and then uh, also, Ryan is a judge, and he'll be judging again in the next week. Uh, Ryan's a really popular judge. You'll see him walking his beat, and there will suddenly be a judge call, and he will scurry over uh, quickly and promptly with attention and uh, diligence. And the person won't even have a judge call. They'll just... I want to talk to Ryan. That's how nice of a guy Ryan is. And uh, Ryan will judge you based on the content of your heart and not the color of your skin most of the time. So, so, so that's good. That's better than me and you, I think, Will. Uh, most of the time would be with a little asterisk next to it. If you say so. We know so. <laughs> Says the guy with beer in his head. Yeah, exactly. So anyways, uh, we're starting late here. That means we're going to be here till 3 in the fucking morning now. Good work, Ryan. Man down. It packs down. Right. Liquor hasn't even been poured yet. And did any of those go in the box, Ryan? There's one in the box. Okay, there's <laughs> one in the box. What's in the box? Yeah. So anyways, I got to do my sponsor. Gave me $25. Please be something related to a snake. Why does that have to be related to a snake? Because that was, that was entertaining when one was. Something about snake bells or something like that? Uh, snake bells? Yeah, I never got that installed in my house because my neighbor did and he said that it was terrible. It was supposed to like let you know when a snake was coming. They put all these things in his yard and he had little bells in his house. And he said whenever like anything went through the grass, it would let, set it off. So like a breeze. <laughs> oh, no. So he said it was going off like 24-7 and he's an old man. He's like 60-something. He, 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 they wouldn't remove it until he started threatening to sue him for elder abuse. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I could hear it. He was and he was shoving he was shoving like fucking quilts down those holes to try and block the sensors. So so he was I saw him out there one day and he was like shoving I didn't know what was going on. He was shoving fucking quilts in the ground. Ruined those quilts pretty fucking bad. But anyways, a quilt uh, is a fancy blanket. They're nice, especially the handmade. Uh, okay, so I got a question for you, Will. Do you ever eat? Actually, this is for Ryan. Now I think about it. Ryan. Do you enjoy? Do you ever eat? <laughs> <laughs> no, man. I'm 310 pounds. I, know, I, yeah. I, I willed it so. <laughs> because I because I, I, <laughs> I willed it so. That's a great. I've never heard that before. Uh, Ryan, do you like to eat healthy sometimes and feel good about yourself and like you think about what you're putting into yourself and. It's like, boy, that was just pure grease. I shouldn't put this in my mouth. Steak and cheese. Yeah. 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 2,300 yeah, calories. Ryan, Ryan cares about his image. Uh, and, and you can really tell by the way he dresses sometimes and uh, looks himself in the mirror at Shane's. And, uh, <laughs> hmm. 
I wish I could grow a beard, but I can't let the other ones know. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, uh, Ryan, there's a new store I think that's perfect for you. That's all about your health. I'm talking about Pedal Peats. What's the name of the damn thing? <laughs> green pe Pedal Peats. I, I, I just call it Pedal Peats. Healthy and green eating establishment. So you can go there and get delicious, uh, healthy food. Pedal Pete is the mascot, Ryan, like uh, Ronald McDonald is from uh, McDonald's. Uh, so you don't have to run for these like the other sandwich place. No, there's no running involved. You drive your car up. <laughs> uh, Pedal Pete is a clown, and he wears big clown shoes, overalls, a sunflower scarf, and a plush turtle on his head, like a beanie baby turtle, which I don't know why. That's pretty good there. Sounds like most of the hipster attire. Probably. Uh, so they also told me that they do not appreciate us going there. It's supposed to be green and recycling and all that stuff. If we show up in my truck, your truck, or Ryan's Suburban, Pedal Pete might chase us off. Because we are not, we, we're supposed to go there in like fuel efficient or electric or what hybrid cars. So don't drive your big truck there. What else did they Prius say? Prius or no balls. <laughs> yeah. Uh, let's see uh, here. So yeah, they said that it's got good healthy eating options. Now Ryan, I went there. They gave me the $25, and this is coming from my own heart here, to tell you about my experience there. Okay, The main meal there is... By the way, me and Ryan went to Chick-fil-A. Ryan's never been to Chick-fil-A. How was Chick-fil-A, Ryan? That's good. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we went there in Texas. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's amazing, Ryan. You feel more conservative now? <laughs> you might vote for Trump a little bit easier now? <laughs> yeah. I, hell yeah. But anyways, uh, Ryan, when I went there, their main meal consists of uh, grass clippings, dandelion stalks, and Cobb molasses oatmeal for beef cow. Do, do they pour sugar on it? Because it sounds pretty, pretty, pretty strange there. There's no sugar. They just hand you a big old bowl of this stuff. And Ryan, when I got it, I looked at it and I said, "What the fuck is this?" Like literally. But I was polite and I tried to eat it. And I was like, "This is shit. I can't eat this." So across the street, this is this is not part of the sponsorship. That's my sponsor. But across the street is Tubby Ted's Burgers. This is out by Lake Walker. There's Tubby Ted's Burgers, and Tubby Ted is a real man. Remember, Pe uh, Pebble Pete is a he mascot. Said. Tubby Ted is real. So just remember that. He sounds like a man. A man? Yeah. He, well, he is. It's not a, yeah. it's not a transgender. <laughs> he, he doesn't sound like, he's saying he doesn't sound like a horse. What? He, doesn't, yeah, he, he's sounds, a man. he sounds like a man. He is a man. I mean, his first name's not Tubby. His first name's Theodore, but he goes by Ted, and he's a big fat man, so why not play off it? Tubby Ted, he's got a successful business establishment. There's a big-ass burgers there, okay? Like, <laughs> I go there, and I eat, and I eat one and a half. That's all I can eat, and I feel bad for eating that much. I feel like, fuck, my life expects these dropped. Will, you could probably eat at least two. You're a big guy. Ryan, I think you might be able to get one down you, because you, you eat like a bird. You kind of peck at food. So, <laughs> so anyways, it turned out that since Tubby Ted has gotten so much flack for his unhealthy burgers and his own weight, which by the way, he's always told me he's gonna lose weight, but he never fucking does, so he's just lying, is that he opened up Pedal Pete's across the street to try and get healthy people to go over there, eat that shit, and say, this is fucking shit, and then come back over to his place and pay him twice. So they pay Pedal Pete's, hate it, come back to Tubby Ted's, and pay him again. So he's like, you stupid motherfuckers. That's how he sounds. Like when he tells people to fuck off, he's like, fuck off. <laughs> that's how he sounds. Just, oh shit. Yeah, yeah man. Oh shit. <laughs> just, I, I, he can't talk right because he's got three chins. It like blocks his airflow or something. So, anyways, that's uh, Pedal Pete's and uh, I guess Tubby Ted's. I'll throw him there. He didn't give me $25, but he did because he also owns Pedal Pete's. So I, throw feel, him. I feel like you made up all of this. <laughs> well, I didn't. <laughs> If you want to go get some fucking grass clippings, dandelion stalks, and cob molasses oatmeal for beef cattle, hit me up and we'll head down there and you can put some of that in your mouth and tell me how you feel. Is it, I'll be like, is it fake now? You I'll, can't tell it, but I'm grimacing. It's bad. <laughs> have you ever tried to buy into a dandelion stalk? Uh, no, can't say I have. Yeah, it's pretty fucking gross. I, I was told bugs live in there and I avoid. I don't know. Anyway, it's also got another $25 uh, from another sponsor. You guys may remember old Reed Davis gave me $25 again to say hi and tell us how much he enjoys the show Frasier. 
So it's not an easy twenty-five dollars. You guys ever seen Frasier? No. Yes. It's pretty boring. It's like I'm going to the opera. It's like how's this comedy? Because people have nostalgia for Cheers. I like Cheers. That's a good show. You ever seen Cheers, Ryan? No. That's okay. Yeah, it's Ryan. was born. I'm, I'm uncultured. Yeah. Well, you're pretty cultured in terms like you went to SakuraCon and you were like, oh my god, look at all. The if I went there, like, what the fuck is all this, right? <laughs> it's so colorful. There's so many What's titties drawn and not. What? Oh, oh, you're talking about the cosplayers. I was like, what are you talking about? Yeah, Ryan, uh, did you get to get any nice pictures with any of these ladies, or can you uh, talk to any of them? No, I mostly keep to myself. Oh, you didn't go with friends? Didn't you go with Walter or something? Yeah, I was hanging out with them. Mostly. Okay. It's a fun place. I'd be okay looking at the Dragon Ball stuff. Yeah, There's like plenty of that, sure. let, let me tell you. Yeah. I have a card game where you just go up there, and some people just go there and play Magic all day. <laughs> Yeah, they they put up tournaments too. Like there's like there'll be like three or four in it. Yeah, time. yeah, that sounds that sounds fun. I should maybe go someday. I remember that one year. I think it was last year, Ryan. Like the the poster for that shades had a little piggy on it. Right. Yeah. Do you remember? I I took a picture of that and I saved it. I still have my phone because I love that piggy so much. I was like, what does this have to do with Sakurcon? <laughs> it's like this piggy with like like glittery looking eyes. I, I, I love that. I, I even I even like mm. my girlfriend even like photoshopped it out so it's just the picture of that and I have that too. <laughs> I love that little pig. So anyways we're gonna do our yeah we're gonna do our drinking game here. Uh, yeah so how this works is of course we each open a pack and there's an ultra or secret rare we take a shot. Uh, Ryan's got Jack Daniels, the old sour mash. Uh, Will's got Jim Bean. And I've got Canadian Hunter, the only non-famous brand. But Delicious. It's damn good. It's Don't let it dissuade you. It tastes good. What, my Canadian Hunter? Yes, sir. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And, uh, Ryan, what do you think the best secret rare is in this set? Not price value, but just, like, the best secret rare. Like, years Don't from now will be... Don't be a like, sheep and say no material. No, no material. Yeah, no material. Yeah, no material is not going to be great forever. Um, I want to play it, but I don't want to. I don't want to give it three slots in my deck. No, I. I that is a terrible, terrible late game draw. Uh, maybe sign up mining is the is the little level one dragon in the set. Never yeah, did. it is. Yeah, yeah Rotar. I, I like that card. I don't even know what that does. Let's hope you pull one. I want to read it. Yeah. I have one, and it's like the least popular secret. Nobody even wants that thing. The most popular one's no material. But Sign Mining... It's also incredibly short printed. It's got less than half on average of the prints yeah. of the other one. Sign at Mining is probably the best secret. I like it. Oh, we got an uh, uneven amount here. We'll see. I think Ryan gave himself an extra one somehow. I mean, you got, you're supposed to have 20. Yeah. If 19... Yeah, so we all got 20. So let's go ahead and get our shots poured. Uh, what's the record? I think I had the record for most shots taken. I think I had to take... Somebody got nine and somebody tied it with nine. I know that. Is that it? So nine's the yeah, highest? I think, I think you and I have both. Both of us had nine? Okay. That's a lot of shots, Ryan. It is. Yeah, I'm not planning on doing that. But yeah, that's... <laughs> I don't think it's up to you. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, I guess it was up to you. Yeah, we, we, we can, we can stop. We're allowed to stop. Yeah, if someone starts feeling too weak or anything, oh. we, we can... Be better to stop than oh. not the alternative. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's it's never good. To, if, if, like, we're only, like, halfway through and somebody's already got, like, 12, which is impossible for halfway through. But, you know, six in there and we're yeah. at, like... Yeah, oh, there goes Ryan. Danger, okay. Oh, I've never even seen this Isn't this thing. discard a, a one of the good dangers and then search whatever the ones you want? And it it says discard one level 5 or higher danger monster, add one level 4 or lower danger monster from your deck to your hand. You cannot spell some monster this to turn after this card resolve except danger monster. It's fucking ass because of that. It doesn't even it's have the discard terrible. effect. It's so bad. It's so bad. It's so bad. <laughs> Oh, I'm in there too with you, Ryan. I got this terrible requires three level five or higher link monster. I thought that card was pretty cool. You think it's cool? Is, doesn't, isn't that the one that becomes unaffected by everything? I think so. Yeah. I, I pulled one for sneak peek and I read it and I was like, the hell? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I've never even seen that either. Yeah, I remember reading that for the spoiler. I was like, well, it's the towers, I guess. Yeah, it's unaffected by all other monster effects in the game. 
And it says, during your main phase, this card is linked summon using three monsters that have different th three different types and attributes on the field. You can destroy all other cards on the field. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> you need an Earth, Wind, Fire, a Beast, Fiend, Spellcaster. And they all have to be level five. <laughs> like, not even higher, just straight up level five. Dude, good fucking luck. That card will never see play. Oop, I seem to have jumped the gun here. Yeah, hold up. It's okay, nothing exciting. Oh, you forget to bring that in? No, it's already. It was like oh. Hour. That was like an hour. Yeah, because we were waiting for Will for so damn long. I know, I'm a fucking no dirty scoundrel. Uh, no dirty, you're a very dirty scoundrel. I'm a no good dirty scoundrel. Yeah, there you go. Uh, you guys can go to all right, well, we gotta wait for Ryan there. We don't want to get. Well, I got a, a beast. Yeah, that thing's terrible. Ryan, what's your one word opinion of Super Quantal uh, archetype? Red layer. <laughs> <laughs> That's a pretty good assessment. I mean, the, the support was like not bad. It's pretty good. All right, I'm in there again with this terrible Valkyrie's Embrace. I do like the artwork for the hug. This is one where it's like if you control. Only Valkyrie monster in one attack position. Valkyrie monster you control on one face up monster where your opponent controls. Change the target. Change your monster to defense position. If you do, banish the opponent's monster. It's not bad, but. I'm gonna have to read that again a little weird. Yeah, no, the new Valkyries are not, not good. But they keep taking up altars and secrets, Ryan. Why? I don't know. It doesn't make any sense. They're too scared of Mr. Oh, the, the time card? Yeah. Well, they should be, I mean. How many cards have skipped your opponent's turn so far in Yu-Gi-Oh? Like, three? Two Do three. we want to consider the one that I mean, was a time seal as one of those? I mean, the best, the world. Is the yeah, the world's the only one I've ever seen that's actually used. That's use. a good card. All right. Wasn't it they skipped their turn and the other one was like they can't summon or something? Like either way it was good. I, I can't uh, remember. The world has a bad effect. Yeah. Someone. I think it's like you second monster every yeah. time or something. I got my favorite artwork of the set. There it is, Ryan. Star Staring Starling. Hey. That is quite the name, too. That's a really good name. They for had to star. try. Had to yeah. Try I love this artwork. It's colorful. It's got a visibly confused bird. <laughs> <laughs> There's just... What's visibly not confused. <laughs> Dude, you missed Tom's rant today, Will. He had an angry rant. Some guy came in, tried to buy a playset of commons, and he wanted them for 15 cents, the playset, because online they're five cents a piece. And Tom was like, I gotta sell them for at least a dollar for the full playset. It's pretty mad. I'm getting all the ultras here. I got a Salmon Great Recurrence. I gotta buy a Kashi Will. Well, hold up, Ryan. I gotta take a shot here. Oh, did you? Oh, you're going. Yeah, I'm going in again. It's Salmon Great Recurrence, which Foxy and Foxer are mating in this artwork. It's you know, very, I think I remember reading that, and it was it, It's not bad. I, I, I think it's okay. And it's one of, like, the two cards you can search or something with that with the new one. Maybe this is the only card you can search now. I don't know. Normal spell card. Right, so you can add... Uh, I don't know what you can add. All right, it, it, it's a good card. I like it. That's a one-off. That's a one-off. For sure. All right. Is that the one that adds two from the graveyard? Yep. Yeah, it does. Add two, and if this set card is sort of a card effect, and since the graveyard, you can add one sound where spell trap card from your deck to your hand. Oh, it's any spell or trap. You can add any of them. So you can get your Ash back, and then use this later in the turn, or at, at the end of your combo? Oh, uh, yeah, so I you to make a deck. Oh, fuck. Uh, <laughs> God. I got Logie's Flame. That's a gross card, too. How about this uh, Destiny Hero Dominance? That's terrible. Here's this Cyber's Reminder. I have to read this thing. I, I saw this card earlier, and it's a, it's fucking like a... Uh, obviously, they took uh, from uh, Transformers. Clearly, that's a Transformer. But can we all press F to pay respects for the fact that they made a Cloudian support card? I can't believe that. When I saw that card in there, I just I could not believe that Cloudian got a support card. That's the worst archetype ever made. No, it's not. I mean, no, it's not. What's worse? It's got to be worse archetypes than that. Ninjas are pretty bad for a while. I mean, it's got like a concept. Something. Some of the like level four guys are pretty good. The one that makes a token? Yeah, the ones that make tokens. 
I know people were trying to use I'm those. I'm not saying it's good. No. It's awful. You but can't say they think it's worse. good. Yeah. I don't know about worse. I mean, when I think of terrible archetypes, clouding comes first. Really? Yeah. Unless you're going to try something stupid like Will says, like Soitsu. I don't consider that an archetype. There's no spell Soitsu. or traps. Soitsu. Yeah. Yeah, that's the worst archetype but right there. There's no there. spell or traps at all with them. That's an archetype. It's all monsters. They're terrible. Got Chain Hole. I love the artwork on this new Magical Musketeer card. It makes Casper look so... like It makes him look like Bandit Keith. I still have not gotten one. Yeah, Ryan got a... I deserve this of hope for being no good. Yeah. Just roll. Memories of Hope sounds like a Legend of Zelda game. Like Legend of Zelda. It does sound... Yeah, that, that, it rings, does. that rings yeah, a little bit. Yeah, yeah, it sounds like it would be one. All right, well, get in there. Mm. Another one of these Super Quantal Mech Beast Luster X. What do you got? Oh, shit, Ryan, how do you always do this? How does Ryan always pull the best card, almost? It, like, that's insane. That's, like, the same price as no material. Hey, I actually had somebody buy this crescendo for me once. <laughs> yeah, that's a good card. They couldn't wait. They had, they had to have the super right away. Good work, Ryan. So that card is terrible in OCG, but I have a feeling that card might be good. Does OCG have the, have, the, have the same time rules? No, again? they don't enforce it, I guess. Oh. So, so, so. Yeah, so so here, that might be good. <coughs> that could be a great side deck card. It's got nice artwork. I like it. What's it called over here? Spooky Dog? Ghost Sister and Spooky Dogwood. <laughs> nice. So at, least, that. at least they didn't get it messed up like the first girl. Spooky they, they've dog. only messed that up once. It should have been so. It should have been, was it Ghost Girl? should have been like... Finish that off, Ryan. Spooky just girl. Just take the swig for getting the, yeah, the, just like pour the it second in most expensive card. No, no. You don't have to, Ryan. Still, there's go. a significant amount still in here. Yeah, yeah, that bottle's pretty wide. All right, here we go. Good work, Ryan. I'm always so proud of you. You know, so, they, they altered the art on this. Did they? I didn't know yeah, that. She has, a, like, a nun hat. Oh, they changed it. Oh, oh okay, yeah, I see it now. Now she's just got, a, just got a headband on. Yeah. Okay. Hey, look, chain hole. I got Dirge of the Lost Dragon. I wonder if I can even catch up to you guys now with three apiece. <laughs> I don't know. Me and Ryan are going to get pretty fucked up. Uh, that Ryan's only got the only secret rare right now. In theory, there's three more. Three more, yeah. And then what, four? I've got three ultras. ultras. Ryan's got two, so there should be at least three more ultras. Weather Painter got support. What do you think of Weather Painter, Ryan? is supposed to be like the rival to Magical Musketeer. I mean, I love their main monster. Yeah. All their main monster. You're terrible. Yeah. I actually like the one all they would have to do is just summon themselves and do nothing. Yeah, the one card that's actually good against they're actually decent against Thunder Dragon because they have that one card that 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 trap card that makes so they can You're be a compulse anytime. Yeah. That's actually pretty good. Got a crackdown, that's a good ass super rare. Yeah, hold on to those. That's a good suit. That's a that good is suit. quite the card, folks. You can almost take a shot for that. No, I'm not going to. <laughs> We're not breaking the rules just for a crackdown. <laughs> I would if it was like fifty dollars super. I like that they were putting ninjas back on the back, back on the card. There. Yeah, people like that artwork's kind of weird. That card came out so long ago. That was like, was Strike and Neos or something like that. Like way, way old. Yeah, I got Loki Slim. Hold up, let's make sure we're all at the same time here. Okay, go, go, Will. I don't want to get where all of a sudden the one guy has to take a shot all by himself. <laughs> We don't have very many times where we all take one at the same time. But hey! There you maybe go! Maybe this time is the time. No, I didn't get one. That's the color card. Yeah, that's actually a good looking monster. That's pretty cool. It's not like... I, oh, Jesus! I I really like uh, the box art, though. This is one of the sickest looking boxes. This is the X wings coming out of its back. Hmm. That's pretty cool looking I like monster. its effect. I just wish it wasn't right. so hard to make use of. What were you going to say, Ryan? I wish that the next set had the topologic guy as the... What's the, the topologic card? guy? Well, yeah, I know... The Link 4 that banishes the whole field. Uh, Ooh, that sounds good. I know we're getting another topologic out of a stru yeah. structure deck, right? No, he's not in a structure deck. Well, I think they announced one in the structure oh, deck. Okay. Yeah, I'll have to read the one that you know, and then yeah. I'll have to read the one that I know to you. <laughs> be a great learning experience for both of us. Oh, look at that, Will. I got a Firewall Exceed Dragon just like you, buddy. That card is really common. I saw a list of a dude that opened a couple of cases up, and that was by far, leaps and bounds, the most common one. Well, I think Xcode Talker was, too, out of... If it's an ultra-rare cover monster, they seem to really enjoy 
giving the that to us. Was like Savage Dragon, the cover monster, the last one, and that was the short print. That's why it was like twenty dollars. Uh, the, the, the oh, yeah, yeah, Laboral Load Savage. Oh, you're right, that was an Ultra 2. It was yeah, a short it, print it was Ultra. actually really short printed. It was still, it's still like 15 or $20. What do you think of that card, Ryan? Savage Boral Load? That's a card. Really, really yeah, like that's, that's a great card. Oh my god, Lance. Catch your lucky stars. Dude, two of them! <laughs> Holy shit! Somebody's got their side set now. Yeah! <laughs> Hell yeah! Did you even open up your shit? No, I. I think I did. What? I think I, I think I just jumped the gun too. Yeah, I may, I may do it. I've six, got yeah, okay. one, one, two, six, three, four, okay. five, six. Yeah, so you're one ahead. It's okay. Yes. Yeah, so how many you got now, Will? Six. Okay, so let me and Ryan open here. Good boxes. So far, so good. Because there's not really a bad secret. Or they're all worth a, they're all worth enough money to where you don't really lose anything on a box. Yeah, even the worst one is still like twenty bucks. As of filming. Alright. Alright, you get your shot, Will. Sippy time. See, you're almost caught to Ryan and you're not that far behind me. I'm at four. Man, let me see this thing. That's funny, Rob was trying to get this against you, Ryan. He's trying to find this and then time expired. Is that what he was trying to find? Yeah, that's what he was trying to dig for, so then you'd special summon a monster and then he'd just activate that. Oof. <laughs> in time, and he'd win. By the way, how'd you guys do today? I didn't get to... Terrible. I went 2-2, two, two, Ryan went 1-2-1. One, one. Really? Playing with true Draco. Got fucked up by triple eruption. Monster oh. Fuck, it was so bad. Ryan got fucked up by Mystic Mine. Oh, well, there's that Cloudian card again. Look, feats of strength. Ah, mm -hmm. terrible. That's what, that's what Danger needed, right? A fucking equip spell. Alright, I got a secret myself. I got the Synchro on Ib, the World Chalice Justice Seer. I'm told that just it's just a, like Dang Long. Just a car. Oh, is it? They put an I in there, right? It's C I A R. Is it? Yeah. Just a cater? Just a Seer R or something. <laughs> Interesting. That's weird. I don't know why they changed the name. Her, her OCG name is Miko, which means like Shrine Maiden. So I don't know. Is this thing any good, Ryan? Yes, the card is very good. I, I heard a lot of people picking up two of them for the yeah, next. Yeah, read it. it. It may not be played right now, but it's really good card. Yeah, I've never even read this thing. It says search a card and summon a card, so you know, you're in pretty good territory. That could get abused, I'm sure. Oh, yeah. And those are good cards, those searches. Still no They're all World Chalice, power. though, aren't they? Oh, what'd you get, Ryan? Oh, you got the, got the Mermail? <laughs> <laughs> I haven't actually read that this. That thing sucks, unless you're playing Mermail, I guess. I could make it still, right? I could make it in Thunder Dragon because I have one Nessie. Two Nessies make that. And they're. Imagine the. You could, you could Reaper Ocus into it. That's pretty good. Oh, yeah, I could. Yeah, you're right. Your deck yeah, this is not. Summon sorcerers. This, this is not spicy. I'm sorry. It's not very good. <laughs> it's <laughs> it's Mermail. Mike my, my at the shop at a, at a at Carter Shins is really excited for that card, and I don't see it. I think uh, I think the water monster they already had. I think the mermel monster, the mermel players are just in denial. <laughs> uh, yeah, I say they, they need a good card. Uh, you want to help me here? I don't want to like spill your liquor. Eruption. Help you? It's just a, it's just a thing. Are you that wasted already? What? I mean, you yeah, got man. Why would you spill your alcohol on your floor? You've done it. Have I? Yeah, you spilled it on that number C one hundred one. Oh, that wasn't on the floor though. I'm sure you bumped me. No, I did not bump you. I have video evidence. <laughs> it was almost a catastrophe a couple minutes ago. It was, yeah. We, we do bump each other a lot. Okay. It sounds gay, but whatever. <laughs> bump in the net. We <laughs> bump each other a lot. Oh, God. <laughs> Another Legend of Zelda Memories of Hope. Oh, look. <laughs> Another super. Four Watch out, so guys. Standing might get used with the layer of darkness. Well, we, got, we still got one more secret to get. Two, three, four. And Will's got an ultra. How many ultras you got, right? Three. three. So we have all the ultras potentially here. But there should be one more secret. Unless, there. I hear this set has the most boxes in a long time of getting just one secret in a box. Let's hope that's not the case. 
Well, all box I've opened up two so far. Three guys at the shop already. Oh, there, oh, there is. he is. Okay, so we got two ghost girls and two those uh, are, ibs. Those are good secrets. Yeah, I like it. That's nice secrets. artwork, too, on that ib. Oh, yeah. I she looks nice. She, she does look nice. The rare. Oh, I'm the only one. Yeah, what are you doing? What the hell? <laughs> he mistook that, uh, what is that, Super Quantal card? <laughs> what is that, Ryan? I don't know what that is. What the hell I'm not is that? The hell with it. Trash. Fill it. All right, there we go. Okay, open up. You need me? I'll help you. I'll help you before you even fucking ask. There you go, buddy. And I spilled anyways. <laughs> Very be, full bottle. Here we go. Be careful. I was trying to do it. It's pretty yeah. See, Jesus Christ. Be careful. Yeah, you gotta. You can't. You can't pour bottles. I'm like sorry. This. There's a stain in your. In oh, your my Savage, Savage Strike, strike man. man. That's a good one too. It's actually got a relevant monster. Damn it, no! Damn it, no! People are gonna be smelling that for years. Alright, we got three. So technically, we are at max, everyone. So I guess I'll win unless Ryan can surprise us with an additional Ultra or Secret Rare. Because there's eight Ultras, four Secrets on the table right now. We're all winners because we all have friendship. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Time for sex later. God, oh, Jesus! <laughs> oh, he did it! <laughs> oh, oh, no! Couldn't have been at least a good card. Yeah, it could have been a Dengursu, but no, it's not. That card is so hard to pull, that Dengursu. That card is worth more than almost every secret rare. I know, there's only three secrets worth more than it right now. And Ryan, I saw the power of the Dengursu and Bobble against Destin. Dude, he, that card's so good. Yeah, so he, good. He, he summoned, like, I can't remember how he did it, but he managed to send fucking Colossus and destroy my Ceruja during my end phase. It was insane. I was like, yeah, what the fuck? Because Bardiche pops a card. Oh, Bardiche, yeah. Yeah, that's how he did it, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Ah! It was, like, devastating. It's, it's so weird because Bardiche was printed so long ago, but for whatever reason, they included the ability to spe only special summon the XYZ monster. Yeah. Not just XYZ summon. Oh, there's a money super, at least. Oh, Mystic Mine, that's a good uh, one. Yeah. <laughs> the card that's making shops change their ban list to the thing they want. So, this card has one of the weirdest artworks I've seen in years, in terms that it's Whitefish Salvage to add a fish that, I love that card, dude. You that's do? Cool. I saw, I, I don't know if that's like an import or something. I, I've seen that card so long ago, and it's just finally getting imported. Well, I mean, it's, it's good. good. It's good. It, it's good for fish. I mean, it's it had sad, a different the, name before. I do remember the, that card. The, the only, the only fish, name. good fish card is banned forever, so it's kind of Yeah, Fish for a Blaster. Yeah, it's kind of gone for a while. <laughs> I love for a well, long that, time. I like it's coming back. I, I, love, I, but, love, I love me some fish for <laughs> When you go to Ivers, you don't ask for the five fish, five piece five flaky fish. You ask if you can get Fish Pick up that fish one blaster. <laughs> Unbanned, <laughs> sir. <laughs> but this artwork doesn't make any sense. I don't know what's happening. Yeah, I don't know. This has no, There's not even an ocean like, to he's make like it. A, like a priest, like a. He's shrine. like a priest. I'm like pretty sure the, o, the OCG word, like part of the name, was white supremacy. So <laughs> the name definitely <laughs> had to be changed. Yeah, 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 yeah if that's the case, like I'll have to look this card up now because I'm really. Confused. Yeah, I mean, I might be wrong, but I remember seeing that for a long time. Ago. I think it is old because like it deals old. with fish. Because that was when they were doing the white dolphin and stuff, you know. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, here we go. Oh, Will got another one. I got a crack down. Oh, that's a good super. Okay, here we go. This is my chance for me to beat Ryan. I failed. I got fusion destiny. So me and Ryan have tied. Here, I'll, I'll pour one. All right, pour one just for old time's sake. So, what do you think of the boxes, guys? These are as good as they get. Yeah. These are more more so because these are secrets that will last. Especially the Miko. I think Miko will hold value for a long time. You mean Ib? Sorry, I, I call her Miko, that's what she's called. You Mico. fucking weebo! Yeah, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Oh, Genuinely, I mean, I mean, this, right, this card is really I mean, good when you read it. I mean, you're right. Miko's just two words. It's Shrine Maiden in English. Oh, okay. Sometimes yeah. they, it's really hard to predict what they're going to do with the names because, like, Denko Seka is completely yeah. Japanese. I don't know. I mean, I guess they thought, like, Miko, like, they didn't want to translate it to Shrine Maiden because it sounded religious. I, 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 I want to say because Miko. And they didn't want to leave, leave it as Miko because it doesn't make it mean anything in English. I think there's already a Miko card that's like a dolphin or something. You might be right. Yeah, so there is. Like, I, I think right, there yeah. is one called a Miko. Yeah, I that's mean, straight uh, up just Miko. Yeah, the word Miko is really common in, like, Japan. Japan. You bringing that up reminds me of uh, 
It was a really old card. It was some whale. I think it was some assault orca from like a yeah, yeah, of yeah, chaos orca, that yeah. shoots the shellfish to pop monsters. Yeah, and yeah, yeah, like yeah, a yeah. Dolphin to kill back row. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're right. Yeah. <laughs> Can you believe how expensive Fortress Whale is now? It's still under current one time, and it's like almost four hundred dollars. <laughs> For really? Fortress Whale. Isn't, Fortress that a, Whale. Is, isn't that approaching Morphing Jar now, basically? It is, yeah. It's because Morphing Jars has reprints. All this right, is never reprint. All right. Oh, damn. We should have waited to clack glasses. Well, we can still wait. Hold up, Ryan. Let, let, let Will take his yeah. shot. He you, wants want to, you want me to take another free shot? I mean, you can take a fifth if you want. Oh, wait. You already took your shot? I took the shot for the card. But you didn't take a shot for like us clicking the, glasses at the, like end the end? For us all celebrating being friends and drunk? Do you, do it during time. All right, yeah, instead of didn't spill it, you I spilled it a little bit. Why don't you just pick up your damn shot glass like like how everyone else pours it when it's that Because I'm an American, and I do as little motor function as possible. That sounds like a starving North Korean. They don't have much, <laughs> they don't have much motor function. I thought they had a ton of fat people there. At least that's what they say. Uh, I doubt it with concentration camps. Generally, fat people don't exist in concentration camps. All right. Concentrating all that fat burning. <laughs> By the way, I'm going to use your thing. I've willed myself to become this way. <laughs> I'm going to use that. But it's even funnier because my name is Will. I know. I willed it. That was pretty good. But yeah, you should have been there for Tom's rant. That was pretty fun. It's a good rant. One dollar. Got to sell him for a dollar. All right. Good work, man. Uh, I don't know how this has always happened, but I've never pulled the highest value card I, out of I think this is the most even one we've had. Yeah, five, five, four. One. Yeah. I swear you got like the big card one. No, I didn't get the big card. I think I did pull the most. Usually expensive one card. person's like. Totally didn't you, didn't you get a Phantasm yeah. out of the last one? No, no, I pulled no, that out of sneak peek. The yeah. highest rarity card that I've won the whole thing wasn't even the highest rarity card or the most expensive card was. I got a Nightmare Unicorn one time. And that's before it spiked up. It was like twenty bucks when I pulled it. I was like, oh, Nightmare Unicorn's the best one. It's the shittiest. Hey, that card is still know. fucking I, good. I, I yeah, this, I know. Yeah, I pulled a super expensive one. You pulled a pot of extravagance. Oh, yeah. You yeah. pulled Trickstar Reincarnation, it was more expensive than anything, even Firewall. You pulled uh, Danger Nessie. When oh, it was my God. Was Reincarnation in the Firewall pack? Yeah, it was. Holy cool. shit. It, Nessie aged well, eh? And Nessie aged well. <laughs> uh, Ryan always does it. I mean, I think out of all the ones we've done, Ryan's gotten it. Oh, now he's uh, tied. He, he got two secrets here. So yeah. Hey, we'll, 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 we'll give Ryan the credit on the polls. We'll give Ryan the credit. Yeah, Ryan, you pass out the packs, and you always somehow know to give yourself one of the best ones. He's got the hidden judge knowledge. Yeah, he does. He's such a good it's judge. It's him opening all those judge packs he gets. Call, from. call the judge over, and you don't get that many. I've only gotten judge packs once. Oh, how that feel? <laughs> it's only if they have extra. So how does the judge pack work? You get as an extra. It's, it's literally like those boxes, you know, that they give the packs out of for mm -hmm. entering if they have extra at the end. Oh, so the rumor... Um, unless you're head judge. Head judge always gets packs. So the rumor... I've been told that judge and packs those, those are packs really are, hot. Those packs are not... Well, they're not box rarity. Right, right. yeah. They're like blister packs. So they're completely yeah, they're random. Like, yeah, they're completely random. Like the ones that I got, I got like 15 packs or something, and they were all trash. I yeah. Got like a Valkyrie secret. Oh. <laughs> yeah. And nothing else. I had it was awful. I had where I bought value. like 10 blister packs of Walmart or Breakers of Shadow, and I got four secret rares out of 10, and two of them were Pendulum Magician. Or the one guy with the, you oh, know, the, the best yeah. guy out of Breakers of Shadow. The, 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 that guy was like 150 bucks, right? On like the day. Uh, I, 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 maybe on the sneak peek. He was, he was well oh, over 100. Pendulum Sorcerer. Pendulum Sorcerer. Well, he was well over 100. I pulled two there. of them. He was good. In 10 packs. Well, it depends when, when exactly you pulled them. Because like, right. it was after the list, and like he kind of crashed for a while, and then kind of came back. Yeah, me and Ryan were talking about when while well, you're making this thing so damn late, Will <laughs> was uh, was how everyone when the Ash Blossom has first reprint as an Ultra, people were just barn selling their Ash Blossoms like for twenty dollars the secret rare, and then the Ultra rare became forty dollars. Like I feel so dumb. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that alcohol made me sweaty. I'm like sweating like a fucking whore in church. Yeah, Ryan's like, God, you got a hooded sweatshirt on. I'm a little dizzy, but I'm doing all right. It's good that you're here, Will. <laughs> that was a fun game. That was a fun-ass game. I'm really starting to feel the alcohol. Like, I'm getting really fucking dizzy. <laughs> I just took a six-pack of beer in, like, fucking, like, 20 minutes. Oh, uh, getting, getting up. And you said you were infallible to alcohol. I, I, not immune. I'm not fucking Superman. <laughs> All right, thanks for watching, guys. I'll let you know if any of us die. Peace. <laughs>